Hey guys, PS10 Box, and here's a full review of the PS Vita. So right here, this screen you'll see is a lock screen without a password. You just basically screw this little peel to get in, like so. I find that pretty cool. Then this is the main menu. Screw left, screw right. Up here, there's a little task that are already running. Just quickly go through there. I'm not sure how to close them, I haven't found out yet. So yeah, I just leave them open. Anyways, if you go down, you'll see more apps. First app I'll show you is Near. Alright, so this is the app Near where you can basically see who's playing with the PS Vita and what games they are playing. I can't really show you since no one else really has it since it's not actually fully released but yeah that's that and if you press this little play as playstation button bring it to like an apple ipod sort of thing multitasking you can press home it's in your right there of course is the game on nation racers you click that and you get a little menu like this start click the middle and it starts the game then there's group messaging, can't try that really, no one else. Then you have browser, which I'll show shortly. Friends, I'll show what that is. It's your PlayStation 3 friends, actually. And with it, you can basically connect to PlayStation Network, and you can see all your friends. Like so. These are all my friends that are offline and online. You can add them if you want, and there you go. So they have new messages, and also, if you just hit home back, also see the browser. I can just click start to start it. I haven't really tried it out much, so I don't really know how to use it correctly. But up here is obviously the internet bar, and then you can simply go to a website like Google. No. Dot C O M. No. And hit go and just hit hit the enter button to actually go through it. It's actually pretty smooth. You have a little effect right there. Type in a word. I just write uh, YouTube. Are you guys on? Are you guys on Facebook? Right there. No. There you go. Loads pretty fast. I might make a comparison video. Touch screen. Just click YouTube, like so, download the video, you can't actually watch YouTube videos from what I know right now, maybe there's an app for it, I'm not sure, but when you press it, this is what it shows, um, it's actually earlier saying to install, yeah, that thing right there, Flash Player, but yeah, that's that. And this is just a quick view I'm just showing you guys. And then there's Party, which is just for like PlayStation 3. Create a party. Trophies, show you that. Start. It's basic trophies like on your PlayStation Network. Welcome Part is a built in app for the PS Vita. They have this Mod Nation races, which I have in the PS Vita. You can go to PlayStation Network on the top. And they'll switch over to your PlayStation Network games. Like the games that you actually have for PS3 and combine it with your PS Vita games. So right there, one percent done. Mon Nation, I haven't played it much. Welcome Park, all my games. Well not all but some of them. Not sure why I didn't show all of them. And then if you hit back, you'll see more stuff. Um there's photos, can't show you that right now. But the quality is good. That's what I can show you. The quality is actually pretty decent. And then this PlayStation Store. I'll show you guys that. Remember again, I haven't really looked through all these apps, but I had I pressed them and seen them just a little bit. Um yeah, so you can see it's loading and the Wi-Fi bar is up there. So far I'm liking this little portable device. And in the PS store, PS Vita you can see it's categorized choose what you want. Apps, I need to check those out. I haven't actually seen any PSV games. 
you need a memory card of course to get anything demos etc there you go a whole bunch of games cut that are coming out and already out go down you'll see apps I haven't pressed it before so now you can see it protection plan and stuff <laughs> not much remember it's not exactly out the PS Vita then media I'm not sure what's in there it's probably just some rough music videos of gameplays and whatnot the minis I'm not sure let's check it out just click any title and there you go it gives us a whole bunch of different games I'm assuming you can buy if you have a credit card attached to your account but yeah that's just the basic PlayStation store I might go into that in a different video alright back in the main menu showed you most of the stuff I'm not gonna like go into too much so yeah again these are the stuff that are running go down you can see every music I don't have any music you have your videos I do not have any videos but you can record it's a new software firmware update you can get content manager you plug it in you launch it and plug it into your computer or laptop and you can basically check out different stuff then there's remote play which you can basically view your playstation 3 on your PS Vita I'll definitely make a video showing you guys that I tried it out already then there's maps and settings I'll show you what settings looks like start and yeah you have a few stuff like this basic stuff I like the, really like the fact you keep the more you go up, it really drags up. And yeah, so system update, network, location, and yeah, then hit the PlayStation button again. I'm not sure what else is there to show you since I don't know what else there is. Um, I guess that's about it. But I can if this can load up fast, I'll just show you a quick. Of what it looks like. Mod Nation Racers. So far, it's a sweet game. I bought it today since I actually seen gameplay of it and I actually liked it. Um, it's not loading fast enough, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit back. But, anyways, you can just check out other people's videos or subscribe to my channel, and I'll definitely upload some gameplay clips of it. But, yeah, so you've seen multitasking right here. You've seen most or all of the apps, PS, Store, Near, Explain What To Do, Group Messaging, that's obviously for group chatting. Haven't tried it before, that's just my quick guess of what it is. Then I showed you um, there's maps and there's downloads. Right now there's a chat I had no clue about. Someone invited me to play Black Ops, I didn't know about that. It's cool, you can just send a message saying no thank you or whatever you want. Hit send. It's really easy to type to people on this than with the PS3 controller. That's one thing for sure. So yeah, you seen that? Um not sure what else there is, but just subscribe to my channel and I'll definitely upload more videos about the PS3 constantly. Remember, you've seen it here first, one day before the pre-order release date, one week earlier than the official release date. See you guys later. Leave a comment. Like the video. Thank you so much.